Tech, Columbine, and Sandy Hook impacted the way Americans feel about school security. It is still a big concern all across the country. Now, one local high school is letting students help with their school safety. Eyewitness News reporter Esme Cariega went to Shelley High School to find out about their new See, Tell, Now campaign. Yet another school shooting, this time in Alpine, Texas. A 14 year old freshman girl shoots a classmate. Started crying. It was just a mess. The motive at this point, unknown. Stories like these are becoming more common. But for safety and security analyst Guy Blissner, it's his job to look for potential dangers in schools. We thankfully have never had a school shooting in Idaho. That doesn't mean we won't, doesn't mean it couldn't happen. Certain precautions have been taken to keep kids safe by adding surveillance cameras in order to monitor who's coming and going from campus. But the school, along with Blissner, agree they can't catch everything, so they're turning to students. I'm curious, uh, I'm really curious as well to see what students see as the concerns. It may be well different than what we see. Shelly High School senior Bailey Bean says she's got a couple concerns. I mean, there's not huge things, but just like maybe more doors locked. When I first entered the school through the back door, it was unlocked. I went in and out as I pleased. No questions asked. Bailey says she would feel safer with the doors locked. I think we need to pay more attention to who's in our school because you never know what could happen. That could be really dangerous. Or actually, the doors around the school, is that common to have them all locked? Depends on what you mean by common. Is it best practice? Absolutely. I asked why some doors around the school weren't locked. The administration here, they are as much as possible trying to funnel most of the traffic through the door directly adjacent to the main office. Most of the other doors remain locked unless there's a unique circumstance. The bottom line. So there are a number of things that you're working with on maintaining these things. So, you know, is it best practice? Absolutely. Is it commonly applied? Not as much as I'd like. Bailey, along with other students, got the opportunity today to talk to the First Lady, Lori Otter, about their safety concerns. Kids that no matter how diligent you are, if somebody is going to do you harm, you need to be aware and you need to know what to do in that situation. Reporting from Shelley, I'm Esme Cariega. The First Lady will also be included in statewide public service announcements for the See, Tell, Now campaign.